Hey my friends, welcome back. It is actually Halloween for me today, October 31st, and it is a gloomy, rainy, beautiful day actually. It is so beautiful as I showed you. It's raining, the fall colors are just, I mean, outstanding today. And this is a perfect kind of Halloween weather. So we don't have small children anymore that like to go trick-or-treating or celebrate anymore so we're gonna do what we traditionally do which is I make chili and hot dogs and we just kind of celebrate with family so Patrick is coming over tonight we're gonna actually do his budget I said why don't you just come over on Halloween and we'll work on the budget and get it over with for this week and then you can also enjoy you know have some chili with us and hot dogs and we'll hang out and then uh, I was with my mom yesterday and I said hey do you want to come over or I'm um, you know Patrick's coming over and then Madison actually asked me if she could come over I said sure the more the merrier anybody that wants to come so we're gonna have uh, you know dinner with family tonight it's just gonna be fun if you didn't see my video when we went my last weekend vlog we went to the big farm pumpkin patch yesterday it was just the best day ever having all my kids together is literally my favorite thing ever <laughs> and then once there's grandbabies it's just going to be like having everybody together i know it's going to be harder the more kids you throw in the mix but like if you're a mom you understand just having all your babies together at once it's just there's nothing like it so it was uh, those are like my absolute favorite days so we had so much fun so check that video out if you missed it i'll try to link it above if i remember when i'm editing <laughs> but it was the best day ever and the color the fall colors are just so beautiful i know that it won't be long and they'll be they'll be all gone but anyway welcome back um i'm gonna be making like i said i'm gonna be making some chili and some hot dogs i'm also gonna be making a fun like halloween charcuterie board i thought that would be fun i got a new charcuterie that i just showed you in my last video or like a charcuterie board and I thought, well, why not break it out for Halloween? We'll go ahead and break, break it out for, I know we'll be using it for all the holidays, but it's just the thing now and it's so fun. And so I had bought like a, just like two things maybe to put on it and I thought, I'm just gonna look through my pantry and find stuff to add to it. And I actually found so much stuff to add to it. They're just such a great like snacking board for like before you eat or you do dessert ones. Mine's gonna be more of a dessert one. Just so fun. So um, I, it's a trend that's caught on and I love it. So. Anyway, welcome back. I actually have some housework to do. I have to finish editing. I really want to get that done now because this afternoon after I get Jackson, I want to do just like get everything cleaned up and focus on this evening, but I've really got to get back to my editing. I've been kind of putting it off. I did just film an intro for the video that I'm editing, which is the basement bedroom makeover. I kind of didn't have an intro for it, so I just filmed that. Hopefully you saw that video. Um, it was two videos before this, just the part two of my mom's basement makeover video so anyway i'm gonna get back to editing but i'll catch up with you in a minute okay it's 5 30 and i've been editing and cleaning and doing all those things and i'm kind of running behind but i'm gonna go ahead and start dinner i have to start the chili i need to put the charcuterie board together and i'll show you um madison i don't think she's actually going to come after all long story but she might is probably not coming so I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to put as much on the charcuterie board. I, I'll show you all the things that I have and what I'm thinking, and then we'll just see what happens. But Mom and Patrick are both coming. Marion's actually going to go work out about the time they get here, but he'll still be back to eat. So let me show you what I got. I actually got these cute napkins at Hobby Lobby the other day. They were the only package, and they were torn open, but they were half off, two fifty, and I can use them for Halloween and also Thanksgiving. So I had put some of these like oatmeal cream pies. I have apple cinnamon rice cakes. I have Oreos, some candy, and these maple honey sesame cashews. And then I was going to do some apple slices. And I have caramel dip and also the cinnamon toast crunch dip. And then I also have some churro cookie mix. I'm going to make some cookies. So I'm probably not going to use, might not use these. I don't know. I think this is probably probably plenty for all of us to fill up this board this is the charcuterie board i just picked up at tj maxx it was twenty dollars and it's so cute i mean of course that is the cutest halloween charcuterie board i'm not going that that all out i don't have enough people to eat that much so i actually looked for some candy corn i in this house we definitely like candy corn but i could not find any it was well i couldn't find any at walmart it was all gone so i just grabbed some of the small candy and we don't ever have trick-or-treaters like never and, and if we do in years past it's like one or two so 
that is enough candy if I get <laughs> any trick-or-treaters I also have some candy up in a jar up there that I can use to give out but yeah we just probably won't have any trick-or-treaters but that's okay it's just how it is these days you know not just where we live it's a lot of places actually I'm going to bake these first of all and then put that together So I'm just starting the chili actually. <laughs> I'm put the cookies in the oven and then start on this, let it cook and simmer while I'm doing the rest of it. So I just put some Paula Deen seasoning on some ground beef and then I've like I've shown this so many times. I'm doing a little different today just to make it stretch further. I'm gonna do a can of corn in my chili. It's really good when you do that. But normally I'll do two of these or just two cans of beans, but I'm gonna also do a can of black beans today and then instead of two cans of tomato sauce I'm going to do three and then I'm going to do these diced garlic fire roasted diced tomatoes they sound so good and then I'm actually going to drain all of these I'm not going to put the juices in and I will add water when I add the packets so um, sometimes I drain them sometimes I don't this time I think I will drain them all but hopefully that will be enough to feed all of us and then I'm also going to cook some hot dogs under the broiler and shred some cheese and then I have like Fritos I like to do like a chili cheese dog but I don't like my mom doesn't like hot dogs so she just will probably do like chili with Fritos. I guess I need to turn this on. I forgot to turn this burner on. <laughs> Not looking like it's clearing up for the trick-or-treaters it's still raining and it is so nasty out here so I went in and cut up the apples and I have the dip I think I might wait until the cookies are out of the oven before I put this together just so that I make sure I have room for the cookies or maybe I'll just put it together and the cookies can go on something else <laughs> I don't know it's um, I'm learning as I go I'm just doing this as I'm winging it as I go so I added the apples in the middle just I kind of surrounded them with the candy because I didn't want the cookies to get wet from the apples I just put lemon juice on them and I actually added another apple I think that's five I just wanted to make sure I had enough and then I have the caramel dip the cinnamon toast crunch dip there's my cookies I think I keep having to turn it back on I'm not sure if they're done um, you know then the nuts and the candy and this is plenty just put a few Oreos on there I'll put the churro cookies or a few of them over here on this side where it's kind of dry and that it's plenty for us. Oh yeah, these are definitely done. They're huge. These cookies are huge. Alright, 
charcuterie board is done and ready. Patrick's here and he is going out to help my mom come inside, but I think this turned out so cute. It looks delicious. I had to have a few apple slices in caramel already. Bella's barking. I've got the chili going, so I'm just gonna, it's 623, I think I'm gonna let it cook for like at least a half an hour before we eat. Um, and I guess it's dark now, so if we have any trick-or-treaters, they would be coming, but I'm not holding my breath. You see, Grandma? It's still raining, by the way, so, you know, there probably won't be any trick-or-treaters. Yeah, there's not gonna be any. <laughs> It's a, it's a rainy, nasty Halloween. I mean, it's not nasty. We love this weather. Yeah, yeah it definitely looks like fall. Oh my goodness, Mom is matching me. Oh my word. We're matching. <laughs> <laughs> it's not on purpose. She gave me this shirt. Fall for Jesus, he never leaves. Yep, we're both wearing our orange and black. Got a... I've got some orange. Oh, Patrick's got orange too. <laughs> Bees. Bees. Yeah. It's actually not that cold. Patrick's in shorts. It's not that cold. I mean, That's it's true. cold. Mom's in a parka, in a parka, and he's in shorts. But that is always the way it goes. Mom freezes, and Patrick's always hot. Yeah, she's in a parka till May. Yes. Anyway, Marion just went to work out, so when he gets home, we will eat. Well, we ate dinner, it was delicious. Got a big mess to clean up. We've been in here working on Patrick's budget, but mom wants us to watch. <laughs> She's laughing, pulling up. Did you find it? Well, I'm not sure this is these cat thing. videos. They were just laughing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. The, uh, what are those girls that dance in New York? Oh, the uh, Rockettes. Yeah, they're giving the Rockettes a run for their money. <laughs> <laughs> that was too funny. Those were too funny. Mom was laughing so hard at those cat videos. She's discovered she loves watching those cat videos on YouTube. Um, they just laughed. That was that was fun. Just mainly, Mar Mom, Patrick, and I just hung out and laughed and talked. <clears throat> Marion was gone for a while, and Jackson, you know, he's a teenager doing his own thing, <laughs> but. Um, they just left. It is after nine. It's almost 9:30. I still got to get my video done. I need to clean this kitchen up. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this, and then probably in the video. But it's been a fun Halloween. We had zero trick or treaters, but that's okay. Next year we'll have a little granddaughter to maybe have come trick or treat at our house, or we'll go trick or treat with her. I know we're probably rushing it, but I'm excited for you know little trick or treaters again. It's gonna be so fun to like do all those fun things all over again with grandbabies. So anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and get this kitchen cleaned up. I got a sink full of dishes. I've actually, my dishwasher is halfway full. So hopefully, hopefully uh, they'll fit. I've got some chili and a few hot dogs left so we can eat these tomorrow. Maybe I won't have to cook tomorrow. <laughs> you wanna go outside, Cocoa Potty? It's still kind of rainy outside. It's real foggy too. I told Patrick and mom to drive safe because you know, when it's so foggy and rainy, it worries me. Shooting me with words, but I won't let them bruise. Even though it hurts, I won't show it to you.
hopefully you needed the motivation, the cleaning motivation to get your kitchen done, get something done. Hopefully it gave you some motivation. I definitely, if I wasn't filming it, I don't know that I would have done as much as I did, but filming it gives me motivation, <laughs> knowing it motivates y'all. So it is now 9.45 and I still have to go finish editing a video, so I'm gonna say goodnight, but it feels so good to go to sleep with a clean kitchen. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and you know I love you and I appreciate you all so much, and I'll see you all next week. Bye-bye.